Hello, I am Professor Rios. In this occasion, I'm going to show you how to do a three-point saddle bend. This is a special occasion when, when you are lying down on a conduit, your, the end of your conduit ends before an obstacle, okay? And you are planning for the next corner. The first thing you need to do is to measure the distance between the end of your conduit and the center of the obstacle. That's step number one. Step number two is according to the height of the obstacle, which in this case is round, you have to find out what is the shrink value for that obstacle. In this case, for a two, inch uh, diameter, the shrink value is 3 eighths of an inch, okay? So to that measurement of 15 inches, you add the 3 eighths of an inch. And that is going to be your new center, okay? Now, we continue with the table, or with our application, and for this case, we need to mark the two side bends, and those two side bends, it needs to happen at five inch from the center. So from the new center, we mark five inches to the right and five inches to the, to the left, okay? And those are the three points where we need to bend our conduit in order to overcome that obstacle. One more detail, in order to bend this pipe, it's concrete. The first thing you need to do is to bend the at the center mark. At the center mark, you bend with uh, you bend 40 degrees, 45 degrees, with the back of bent arrow. The back of bent arrow is no, it's not the back of bent arrow. It's called uh, a teardrop arrow. Okay, this one that is over here, teardrop arrow. That happens to be the center of that 45 degree bend. Once we do this, we need to do these two other bends. And how do we do this? It's important to keep that 45 degree, uh, 45 degree bend first, then your conduit bender, and then yourself, okay? You cannot do it in the opposite way. So, using the arrow, then you achieve 22 degrees bend in the opposite direction, another 22 degrees bend in the opposite direction. That way, it will go up and then go down and continue straight. And that's how you do a three-point saddle bend. Thank you.